Now at 5.30, to be part of a world tour at a young age across the United States, South America, China, Thailand, Russia, Dubai, Israel, Turkey, and Lebanon is, of course, a dream come true. And this week's Extraordinary People, CBS 12's Michelle Wright spotlights a hometown star shining bright and inspiring others to live big and never give up on their wildest dreams. Soloist, actress, and artist. Three ways to introduce local celebrity and the King's Academy alumni, Lauren Yerlinkovic. A Wellington resident, she has toured the world and is performing at the Kravis Center with Yanni as part of his Florida tour. And I went to the King's Academy and I started singing at a really young age to the Manhattan School of Music in New York City right after high school. Went there and uh, was in an off-Broadway show, kind of auditioned all around, studied opera and musical theater. Um, but before that, oh my gosh, I totally forgot, I won Star Search with Ed McMahon, <laughs> which was kind of like a big thing. One of her wildest dreams came true when she received a phone call to tour with Yanni, who is a Palm Beach resident. Okay, great. So I guess, you know, I didn't, I had no idea that Yanni lived 25 minutes from where I grew up. Lauren Yelankovic on vocals. No, no, I've been on tour with him and traveling around the world. In a tough music industry, Lauren's family, friends, and fans are her foundation. Well, my family has been definitely one of the greatest supporters that I've ever had, and I um, couldn't have asked for anyone better. They've always been behind me every step of the way. Excited about the release of her brand new CD, Lauren says her life is true to her song, Wildest Dream. She loves being a world traveler, but says there is nothing like performing in her hometown. I get this like feeling of like, ah, I'm home. Lauren hopes her journey to be a professional singer is an inspiration to others to never give up. To really, you have to practice and you have to want it and um, you know and, and there's nothing that really can get in the way of what you want um, so I'd say go for it Michelle Wright CBS 12 News <laughs>